I thank you today we have not come to see any man even to hear any man but we have come to hear from you and also to see you the great God who is going to do my things in our lives and to fulfill your plans and to our lives may you come and speak to us Lord that we don't go back the same way we came in the name of Jesus Christ Amen Amen the day today I want to talk about something you hate most it is the issue of eternal life we thought he was going to talk about Vitambo and demons now he wants to talk about the kingdom of God and eternal life praise the Lord but I want, you to, I want to teach you my friend today that the most important plan of God that he desires of you the reason he saved you in order to enjoy eternal life Amina. Amen. Master plan The master plan of your getting saved. You did not get saved to get money. Even on the side of the devil there is money. Hallelujah. Amen. You didn't get saved to get a job. Amina. Amen. <laughs> but the most I want to show you the most important plan of God go to the book of John chapter 6 Bible reader okay Matthew chapter 6 and verse 38 John chapter 6 and verse Yokana esula mukaga olinjira satu muna Kubanga sava mukuru kukola change ya galans. Ani yogele bigambe. Who speaks those words? Ani. Yes. Yes. Sava mukuru kora nzebi njagala. For I have not come down from heaven. Wabula. To do my will. Wabula odi yantuma chaya galans. Ani yamutuma. Who sent him? Never nice singa gwali ovude mukuru gwe. Na mafutaga yesu kanu geya jana go. Had you been the one who came from heaven with a kind of anointing Jesus came with? Because they talk about him in Isaiah. That he's going to open the eyes of the blind. He's going to set the captives free from prisons. That he's going to resurrect the dead. But he knew that and he passed Persisted. He persisted on his call for which he was called. Read that verse again. Kubanga sava mukulu, kukola change ya galans. Wabulo ye yantuma, chia ya gala. E yantuma, chia ya gala chino, mubonat. Beyapa, alemo kubula nomu. Na ye amzuki rize, kuruna kurenko merelo. Kubira munga lo plani yewana. Clap your hands for that kind of plan. God does not benefit from giving you a lot of wealth on the earth and you get so rich when you're going to end up in hell. Amen. Amen. Continue reading. Kumanda chitange chaya gala chie chino buli muntu ye na alabo umwana na mukiriza abeno obula mwobuta guawu mwongire ngaro yesu kusi. Slap for Jesus Christ. That whoever sees the Son and accepts Him or believes in Him may have eternal life and live forever. When I was in London, there is my pastor, my, my son, Pastor Mugwanya here. He will witness. I found tabs. I found tabs. I found tabs. I 
that you don't age but however much you swallow them you will age by force you will not, not stay forever and ever some people kill other people because of land as if they are going to live forever but he has, he has said when you believe in me you are going to live forever and ever think when you die biologically your life is finished you are a spirit you are created in the image of God God is a spirit you are also a spirit demons are also spirits Jesus is also a spirit even the angels are spirits but amongst all those spirits it is us only who are given a flesh because for us we were put on this earth of the flesh in order to look after the tangible things but you are a spirit wait uh, when you die you will see yourself some of you want to first die and then you will know your spirit Amen. You, you will see your flesh in the sitting room when you are in the space then you will believe that what Pastor Tom told you is true. You might see your aunties or your relatives who died. You buried them. Their flesh are rotten. But they come at night and talk to you. They torment you. You, you too, if you don't die in Christ Jesus, you come and torment us. We, sh we shall burn you with fire. Hallelujah. Amen. A person can live forever and ever. Don't can. Uh, you live forever and ever. Hallelujah. Amen. This flesh is not you. You are a spirit. Sometimes you amaze me. Sometimes you say, My hand is paining. My leg is. For you, or where are you who says, My leg is paining me? you are inside of that body you know yourself my head is paining therefore you are spirit amen the body puts in action what has been uh, fulfilled in the spirit amen amen Go to chapter 3. Go to chapter 3. Verse 16. Yokane Sula Satu, Orinjira Kumino Mukag. Kubanga Katod, Boyagale and Sibuat. No Kuayona Wayomuana way, Eazari Womu Yeka. Bulimuntu Yana Mukiris. Bulimuntu Yana Mukiris are for name Motoka. Uh, whosoever believes in him may get a, a vehicle. That whoever, whosoever believes in him may get married. Is that what it says? That devil has blinded people. He, he diverts us from the plan na of our God. Na he diverts you from your call. Na kujia, na and he takes you on intangible things. Even, even the false prophets are after tangible things. And those who go to the false prophets are looking for material things. Those who go to witch doctors are looking for tangible things. But for us, we are not only seeking for tangible things, we are seeking first the, the kingdom of God and everlasting life. 
Mukama yebazwe. Praise the Lord. Kumanya basingo bunge oroza anti bonono nya obulamu obutagwa okatonda bwa kwagaza. You know most people think that when you seek the eternal life that God desires of you. Oja kubera wo yavu alogweyo. You think you you're going to become very poor. Otura wo ngo rindira bwa kabaka bwa katonda bulamu butagwa. You will sit and wait for the kingdom of God and everlasting life. Amen. Asoko mare chigambe chikuri. First to read and finish the scripture. Kwa katonda bwe yagale nsibwat. No kuwayo na wayo mwana we. Eyasali bwo mu Love for Jesus. Ye master plan It is the major master plan for which Jesus came to the earth. In order for you to live forever and ever. Hallelujah. Amen. For you ladies I normally teach you you know for me I'm, I'm, skill, I'm skillful in womenology Hallelujah. Amen. you know there is a mistake that women make in the morning you, you, are, you make announcements you are prepared tea for your husband and a flask over there plus bread you to get a, a paper of announcement and put it under the flask. Chako is over. The, the bra is broken. It's torn. The husband takes tea when he's uncomfortable. Shake your neighbor and tell her stop. Hallelujah. 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 No woman can take a day without making that kind of announcement. Amina. Amen. When you receive any message at the place of work, of your wife, from your wife, you'll first get worried. Because it is a, 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 a death announcement. The child has been sent for school fees. Another one is sick. Umeme has taken the solido. Tell your neighbor, stop. The other lady outside does not make that kind of announcement. She knows the plan of the husband. The husband wants to be loved. Some of you know only to love your, your, your children. Love your husband. Your husband is the first child home. If you love your husband, and you make him a baby carry him on your laps and feed him with a spoon there even when you don't make announcements after eating on your laps you will say let's go to the bond and you get a car but if you continue announcing you will stop on on your tomatoes but if you get to know what your husband wants he will give you what you list expected but that is how also our God is that when you are established in what is desires of you that is why he says first my kingdom and the rest I will add on that amen amen Try and send him a message even right now. Tell, tell him I'm at Katari. At church. But the whole heart is with you. I'm, I'm already confused. And you see whether he will not take you to, for, to a bond after But for you, your work is to look at the messages that the young lady sent to him. Why don't you send him yours? You're checking your, for those other people. I saw a message and I fell and got confused. I fainted. Amen. Amen. So how does the kingdom of God begin? I mean, you know, how does eternal life begin? Hallelujah. 
Let's, let's go to the book of Genesis. To know that this master plan started from long ago. Before your great grandparent was born. Chapter 1. No, no, no. Let's go to chapter 2. Verse 7. Genesis 2 7. Olberebedie, a sula bidi, or in your room, Sav. Mokama Katod, now moment, nefu fu yensi. Nam fu munyid, omuko goblam. Omutuna fuko mukom lam. Omutuna fuko mukom ram, a baganda wita mukam ram. And man became a living being. The baganda call it a living breath. Omutuna fuka a living being. Nafuko mo yo muram. And, a, and man became a living spirit. Hallelujah. Amen. This flesh was made out of soil. You know God is wisdom. In soil he has put a lot of ingredients. Body cells. That make body cells. That form the flesh. So the plants absorb those nutrients and create food out of them. The sweet potatoes, cassava, and matoke, bananas. That you eat the bananas, you eat the cassava, and your body is built. Hallelujah. Amen. That's the grass that absorbs the, the nutrients. Feeds on the grass and it creates milk out of that. You go and milk it. You give the milk to the babies, and the, the flesh of the babies develops. So the first man, God does not did not need the plants. He got out those nutrients in his own power. And he created the flesh of man. He did not, uh, mo, he did not fashion it like you, you fashion a pot. But he got out those nutrients and formed the flesh. God would be creating every time. But what he did, he imposed a seed in the first man. And he said, go and multiply. I shall not be creating all the time. But after creating that flesh, he went in the spiritual room and he got out a spirit and put it in man and man became a living spirit Amen. What, which he did not do on animals how did he create the animals go to verse 19 mukama katunda Na kola netaka buri nsole yo musiko na buri akibuka wagu na bidetero omuntu okulaba bwana abiye ebe sorobe abikolanga bijja mutaka for the beasts he created from the ground yote efu wa mumoyo he did not uh, breathe in the living spirit kati enkoko ente embuzi tabirina muoyo byonna so the hens the cows the goats do not have a spirit bidina uh, uh, mind no mubiri they have a mind and the flesh na efu twina bisatu but for us, we have three. We have the flesh. We have the mind. And we have the spirit. But the spirit is you yourself, the real you. Amen. The brain or the mind was created in order to have a coordination with the other, the other creation. And you were created as a spirit in order to have a communication with the spiritual world. Hallelujah. Amen. That is why in religion people try to understand God with the physical brain when their spirits are dead and they fail to understand him. But for you Jesus comes and enters you and he gives life to your spirit and then it is connected to God again. 
The brain has a limit in understanding God. It is the spirit that understands God. It is the one that communicates with God. Amen. That is why even when you pray, when your lips are not talking, God will hear when you are praying from deep inside of you because your spirit is speaking that is why God hates evil thoughts amen because when you think about fornication and adultery your spirit is fornicating even when you stop your flesh from fornicating the inner man has already done fornication praise the lord Amen. That is why man is very hard to understand. The, the dog is very easy to understand. When you go back home and you find your dog, when it sees you, it welcomes you and shakes the tail. It cannot uh, uh, shake its tail and then bite you. It means it's happy. When, when it sees a stranger, it stretches out its ears. It means it, it wants to bite. But you cannot understand man. I will come to your place. Then you will smile and say, I'm so happy to see you. But deep inside, you're going to poison me. So this one who, who shows a smile is not you. It is your body that you're telling to, to, to cover up. But inside of you, you have a different plan unto my life. Which the beasts do not do. What an animal is outside is what it is even from inside. But a human being, you cannot understand them. Only God who created him can understand him. Praise the Lord. I normally tell the, sing the female singles the guy can come. Mommy God has showed me that I'm, I'm supposed to marry you. Then you also get excited. But before you get excited, first inquire of God who knows the hearts. Ask him, Lord, this man is an American height. But first show me his heart. Does he want to marry me or he wants to, to hit and run? Hallelujah. Amen. <laughs> Praise our God. Kakati uh yonga mazokolewa. So after the creation of man, church ava uru nyero munana. What happened in verse eight? Mukama katod, na symbol suku, mu eden, kuluyo lwebu vanju, na te komu. I think he had planted it here at Eden. And he planted a garden at Eden. The Baganda call it a, a banana plantation, but it is a garden. And he planted trees therein, which the human beings would feed on. Continue reading. Mm. Mm. And even planted the tree of life. Yeah, he planted jackfruit tree, papari, the purples, ovacado, ovacado, he also planted the tree of life. That these people would feed on in order to live forever and ever. He had not created death for them. He has created them to live forever and ever. Even at this moment, Adam would be alive. And there was no need of Jesus to come. Our father would say, Amina, would, would, would be Adam. Sorry. He planted a tree of life. Mm -hmm. And the tree of knowledge of good and bad. Verse 16. Get a
Olianga kunga bwono ya galanga mm -hmm. na yo mutyo gwa kumanya ngo bulunji no bubi tugulianga ko mm -hmm. kubanga oluna ku ruoli guliyako tolire makufa ngamba kitalo nange simayindi mubuza nga ntuse imu grave ya ato mutyo gwa wateka mu wachinga ajo yagala bantu baguliye i will also ask him when i go back to heaven why did you plant that tree yet you didn't want people to yeah, eat man. it it is. But he told them not to eat of the tree. That the moment you eat on it, you're going to die. Adam and the wife made a mistake and fed on the tree. And death came in. Amen. Amen. If you can see the judgment he made. Chapter 3. Verse 22. Verse 22. Mukama katonda na yo gera antiraba omuntu afuse ngo omukufe okumanya ngo obulunji no bubi kakana aleme okugolala omukono gwe okunoga ku muti ogwo bulam okulia okuwalanga okuwangalanga emirembe ne emirembe gamba kitalo nyo se wo antu na gamba ti akati omuntu wengere ji amaso okononeka that because man is now defiled singa mure kawo na abira we emirembe ne emirembe ne emirembe if i allow him to live forever e sio nege na kubira ngwagwa the entire world will be will, will be defiled amina amen na gamba ti wansi and what did he say mukama katonda ti yava muja mu lusuku eden mm -hmm. alimenge takamwe ya jibwa Bwati ona agoba omuntu na Samuel buvanju ba mulisuku Eden ba kerubi era na ekitale ekimyansa ekichuka chuka okubyo omuti ogwo bulamu mukubira mungaru katonda wa fe love for god na agama anti na ate kawo ekitala ngate wachi ali agdayo kulya ku ntigo abulamu he set up a sword that no other person will ever touch that omuntu yali badde we mirembe ne mirembe ne mirembe man that would live forever and ever olokubanga yononese because he had sinned okufane kuingira munsi death entered the world gena musule mukaga nkulage got chapter 6 olinyi yo oloksatu and verse 3 Olubelebeli Yesu la mukaga olinyirira roksatu mukama nayo gerant omwoyo gwangi teguwa kanenga na mtu emirembe ne emirembe mm. kubanga na yegwe mubiri mm. na yen nakuze ye mubiri omwoyo gufude he's the flesh and the, the spirit was si dead sija kudda yokukontana na mtu i shall never contend with man anymore kubanga yegwe gufude kati akosa mubiri mwerere because his spirit is using flesh. You see all people in the world, their spirits are dead. There is a minister, uh, a minister, we were attending a burial ceremony in Masaka. We were preaching the gospel. And he said for us, the born again. We have not come to pray for the dead. But we have come to pray for the dead, the living dead. They sent him away. He had to throw away the Bible. Yet what he spoke was the truth. Their spirits are dead. They use the brain and the flesh. Hallelujah. Amen. And he said, I shall never strive with man anymore. I've, I've cut his life short. He shall not go beyond 120 years. So even when you swallow the anti-aging tablets, you will not go beyond 120 years. However much you smear yourself with every kind of movit and vaccine, if you want to live forever and ever, just accept Jesus Christ today. Because Jesus came to take us back in the Garden of Eden. Ah, to say, we should find a church that under our mirror, we should find a church that we should be able to meet them. 
to, to give life to our spirits and take us back in the image of God. In order we can in order to live again forever and ever. This time we shall not live forever and ever on the world. But we shall live forever and ever in heaven with God. Why did God bring Jesus, not any other person? Because Jesus, he lives forever and ever. So when he enters you, you're going to acquire his nature and you shall also live forever and ever. Amen. Amen. Why did he bring Jesus and he became man? Because the blood of Jesus it is of a son of, my, of God. Jesus did not have any connection with the blood of the earth. His blood is called It does not have any pestilence, any jealous and anger. It is the only one that can cleanse out of you all the other kinds of blood that the blood of a The blood of a hand cannot cleanse you because it has pestilence. The blood has HIV in it. And it also has coronavirus. But one of Jesus doesn't have any, any Hallelujah. Amen. So Jesus became all in all for your sake. In order to take you back to Eden. Hallelujah. Amen. When we go back to John, the book of John, where we were, chapter 6. Amen. Amen. And verse 22. Sula Mukaga, Orinio Rabbit in Webbidi. Orinaco Rokubi, Etimina Charity Chimidi Day, Emitala Wenyaj, Webalaba, Gateri Yoliat, Dala, Wabule Rimu, Eranga Ne Yesu. Tasaba de wa mumuriatu, naba igirizabi. Na yaba igirizabi, ngaba genda buka. Mm-hmm. Na ya mata amalal, agave tiberia, ngaga kwa bakumpi ne, nejebali de migati. Mukama wafe, boya malo kwebaza. Awitbina weba laba, nga yesu tali yo. Ne wakuba daba igirizwabi. Bobe nyini, neba saba la mumato gali, neba jeka perunau, ngaba no nya yesu. Ngaba no nya yesu. Seeking Jesus. Jesus had already given them bread across the sea. They ate and got satisfied. They, they even collected 12 baskets of crumbs. And they said, Why, if we don't follow this one, whom else can we follow? He's a bread maker all the time. To, to look at the seashore he wasn't there they got hold of boats to seek for him uh-huh. yes mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Sikubanga mwala bobubonero mm. naye kubanga mwalia kumigati nemukuta katonda watu mubuze munno ononye migati wano obononye ask your neighbor have you come to seek bread or any other thing omutawano gubadde kufa abalokolenga katonda tumunonya ako bya magero byoka the problem with born again is to seek for only miracles from god the moment you receive a miracle ngonokusaba Prayers. If you are a single, you can go to the prayer mountain for many days. If you are a single, you can go to the prayer mountain for many days. But after getting married, you are, you are staying at Kololo. Who will come from Kololo to the prayer mountain? Only to, to raise the hands and they are lying. You man, when you are still poor, you have one shot, you will be at the prayer mountain all the time. But if God delivers you, you have become rich, you have six vehicles. 
Say why should I go to the prayer mountain? But I'm amazed with you uh, ladies. Women hate uh, men who are mean. Gamba muno msaje mkoda aketa. Tell your neighbor a man who is mean is is hard to live with. Na kurekere 15 ku meza. He gives you 5000 shillings. Atore guru na kubanja balance. And in the evening he is asking for the balance. Is asiga do zirua. Where is the remaining money? There is a woman who told us. She asked for money for her. Tata John, please give me some money for her. You see, my hair is not smart. And the husband gave her 5,000 shillings. And the lady said, You can take it to your mother. Doesn't she want to go to the saloon? take it to your mother also to braid her hair yet if the if he has been mean and then he starts giving he has bought a car for you he has built a house for you can you move away from him and be independent I thought the more he gives you the more you love him the more you do good things for him one who was not kneeling you start kneeling but how about our God the more he gives us things the more we depart from him Yet you would be the, the, the real person to seek God the more. So these men were seeking him for bread. But what, what did he tell them? Mm. Mm-hmm. Amen. Amen. Clap your hands for that word. We do not only seek for tangible things, but seek for eternal life. In order to live forever and ever more. Amen. When my son was testifying, he said he was going. But the wife cried. He, she, didn't want, she didn't want him to go. Hallelujah. Amen. But Jesus has said, You're not going to die, you shall live forever. As who accepted Jesus Christ, there is no difference between death and life. Because even when you die, you shall continue living forever and evermore. In fact, I want to teach you today that when you get out of this flesh, you life. Because there is no limit at the age. We love the flesh so much, but it has a limitation. But yeah, spiritual life is forever and ever. Uh, I beg your pardon. Either, either you will live forever and ever in hell or you live forever and ever in heaven. You have to make that choice when you are still in the place. Not after death and then they, they lie to you. Oh Lord, you give him eternal rest. You have rejected the, the, the rest. How will you receive it? May you judge him with grace. They are lying to you. I'm amazed with people of the world. You are burnt with fire. And they are making parades here. They name the roads after your name. They don't know how you are suffering. But I'm telling you. After following this line of eternal life whether your flesh has been thrown on the roadside whether it is rotting from a river where you 
your spirit goes is the most important thing. Amen. Amen. Kakati, you want to Continue. Yes, you not damu, never gambant. Guna guamulim guacatunda. O cook it is all you. Guayatuma. Nedda, what which you also will grow chiquatako. Our Nebamu gambant. Two jira two tia, or call a minimuja catund. Yes, you not damu, never gambant. Guna guamulim guacatunda. O cook it is all you. Guayatuma. Our Nebamu gambant. Kale cabonerochi. Gweko okola tulabe tukukirize okola muri muchi mm. bajeje febali range manu mudungu mm. ngabwe chewa ndikibwanti yabawe mmere okulia eyava muguru mm. awe yesu nabagamba na kama ne wakati ne ugo wakati tu njagalo tubuli Musa wano yatuwa ya waba jaja femede ni bali ya nebafunduka katika wano yadochi bali ya medde kumigati they, they told him that Moses gave us ma food and we ate gave Nawe our papa kura, food kabone, ne, e, migati, Me, jifemu, guru, jiku, wan, you, make a miracle so that the bread can come from heaven and fall to the ground mm-hmm. awa yesu naba gambant dala dala mba gambant Musa, si ye yaba we mere, e yaba mukuru. Mm-hmm. Ne chitang, ye yaba we mere, e yama zim, e vamu guru. Mm-hmm. Kubange mere ya katun, ye ye vamu guru, e retere en sobulam. Mm-hmm. Awunibamu gamba anti mukama waf. Tu wenga buli jo, e mere. Katunda wak. No gamba kari no gamba kari no kari no katunda ya jigaba si musa ya jigaba kati gamba katunda watuwe migati he said now we have accepted that it is not Moses who gave the food but it is God who does it now may you command your God to give us that right yesu nava gamba yesu nava gamba zemele yobula aviono nye aviono nye aviono nye Nago gamba zemele yobula mu and he said I'm the bread of life ajajen ejala teri muluma aha asikiris enyoto teri muluma na katuni na yena abagamba anti munda munda mukiriza buli chitange gwampa ali ajajen ajajen siri mugoyera ah ubuka ugenda kwa namu nana go to verse 48 Zemere eyobulamu bajajam bali lange manu mudungu ne bafu eno yemere evamu bajajam bali emere ya mubiri your fathers ate the food it helped it helps that they are flesh they died na yeka wakati zena food omuti guli gwajibwa wakati obulamu obutagwa tutandikira ku sikuno the other tree was was removed but eternal life is started from the world kama obulamu obutagwa ono bufunotya how will you get the eternal life? Jesus came to become the bread. That when you believe in him and feed on him, him you have eaten the tree of life and you are going to get eternal life. And you are going to get the eternal life starts on the, on the earth. You will not die after doing evil and you think you will acquire eternal life from there. It begins from the world. And he said, I am the bread. The other, the other people ate the physical food and they died. I, whoever feeds on me, will never die. Verse 48. Zemere, a yoblam. Bajajam, bari range manu mudungu nebafa. Eno yemere eva mugulu. Omo tu ajiri eko ale mokfa. Zemere na mu eva mugulu. Omo tu bo ariya kumere. Ari ba mula mu emire bene emire. Kubira munga rukatunda. Ah God. And you, whoever was swallowing the anti-aging tablets, just feed on Jesus today. So that you can live forever and ever and evermore. He, this is the gold that God gave to the world. All of us were supposed to die. 
That is why in the Old Testament there was no resurrection. There was no eternal life. It is Jesus who began the resurrection and eternal life. That is why the Pharisees quarreled with him a lot. And they contended with him. Now you're telling us there is resurrection. Now if I marry a woman and I die and my brother takes off you think we shall resurrect when the woman has died who, who will be the owner of the wife? You know those, those men loved so much to marry like the other fellows of ours. They, they told them that in heaven they are prepared for them uh, ladies with very beautiful <laughs> eyes. You will just make a choice out of oh, the Shame upon Jesus said we are going to be like angels no marriage in heaven Amen. continue there and that marriage and the so when you eat the flesh of Jesus we no, we no longer eat the flesh physically but he's in spirit how is his spirit they are the fruits of the Holy Spirit. You know them in Galatians. Like, well, there is love. You love even the unlovable. You lady, you must love a man who is a drunkard and adulterous. Don't say this man will take me to hell. Eat Jesus and love him. Jesus and love him. Eat peace. Eat peace. Eat joy. Joy in your face. The tears you shed. They will take you to hell. Be happy. Amina. Amen. The, the husband has come back with lipstick on his beard. Be happy. Praise the Lord. Our patience. Our God is patient. You have to eat him. And be patient with the mockers, with the, every kind of condition and the words they speak about Amen. Oh, and it is grace when you are compassionate. Do not mercy only I need to Do not mercy only those with problems. Mercy even the sinners. Will you manage the gospel? When the heart. Amen. Who will have be compassionate to him? You say sorry. Tata John has been doing, has been fornicating. Why was God compassionate to you in your sin? Because God masses the sinner. He does not delight in the death of a sinner. But for a sinner to come from his sin and come back to God. One woman was going to be stoned after fornicating. Yes, we are Masasira. And Jesus Masida. And he said, Whoever has never done it, may he speak the first stone. Therefore, when you begin eating Jesus, and you enter his blood, you drink his blood. His blood cleanses you. And he makes a covenant with you. That you come out of the covenant of your family. There is no way you can come out of the covenants of your family unless you drink of the blood of Jesus. And it cancels all the, all the covenants of your family. Clap for our God. Continue. Continue. Mm. 
Ona isa ati oku tuwa mbirikwe Oku gulia Ne baga nti doza kuna kasaji enjiri ya kawedeku And they said it seems this man Afuse kasezi kagala tukaliye buli He has become a man eater He wants us to eat his flesh Na yesu na baga mbati But what did Jesus tell them Awe yesu na baga mbati Dala dala Baga bat, buat mutar, mutar yang mubiri gua mana wamut, kamu ni wamu sayi, yes, kamu ni nak bula mumu, kamu ni nak bula mumu, mungkin dah nak kufa, you don't have life in you, mungkin aku sihkan aku mufana nanti Adam, you will remain in the image of Adam. Mbiri kwangu era ndo musayi kwangu otyo nimuzukiriza kuluna ko olwenko merero aha kubanga mbiri kwangu chicho kuliyadda no musayi kwangu chicho kunywadda aliyo mbiri kwangu era nyo musayi kwangu otyo era muzi nange muyiye kubira mugaru katonda wa nafu a god Whatever you hear, whatever you yearn for is when you eat him and enters your life, he will be in you and you also in him. Whoever touches you has touched Jesus. Amen. Amen. It is written that we overcame him because one in inside of us is more powerful than one in the world. Never evade demons before you eat Jesus. That is why your co-wife has bewitched you a lot. For her she has the devil and he also has the devil in you. What kind of devil? You have hated her. You don't want to greet her. That is why we love her. Forgive her. Jesus has entered you. And then you dedicate yourself in the blood of Jesus. In the covenant of the blood of Jesus. And cancel the covenants of witchcraft. That your co-wife has invaded to be in. And then you invade witchcraft and overcome it. Because one inside of you is more powerful than one in her. Your husband has been bewitched. He left the, the home. He's, he has gone to women. They have put the devil in him. Yet you also have the devil in you. The devil of, of jealous. Of sorrow and worry. Hallelujah. Amen. Receive the spirit of God. And feed on Jesus. And today you are going to hit the witchcraft. And overcome the ancestral demons. And then Jesus is going to obtain. Go to verse 66. Aboku ba yiki risabi, bantu cheba vaba dirira. Nebata dayo kutambuli da wamu na yenati. Gamba nange mbora koka tono kusituka. Say I'm also about to go. Msaji na denga tage na kuri tadi tambo na misambo. I thought we were going to go against the tambo demon. Kawula tuvemo. For the ancestral husband. Katibu na tuvuli ya bora muvuta gua. He's talking about eternal life. But now msaji nebo gamba tu kote kumuvi ya msaji. And they said let's quit and go away. Yari afunya abantu banchi. He had acquired a lot a big congregation. Yari alisi zemigati. Whom he had fed with the bread. Gabama ni agenda bongi na migati mirada. And they thought he was going to give them more bread. Na yengiri na chuka. But the gospel changed. And they said let's depart from him Because they didn't want to follow him anymore Ask your neighbor Do you also want to, to go out? And I saw one lady going out Hallelujah Amen When she, 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 she entered the taxi She had a voice thundering like that And he told her if I want to want life back Go back to the city of Gaza And I will come and give you the life back Then I saw her entering again Then I saw her entering again Then I saw her entering again when we were giving she gave a testimony I had run away from the gospel but God thundered at me in the taxi this is the line that God designed what came next mm. I'm also asking you do you also want to go out 
Aha, kila wasi. Simon Peter na mudamund. Mukama wafu. Tunagenda eriani. Oli ne bigambe byobulamu obutakwa. Ah, kubira mungalo katonda. Gamba ze Petero walero. Say I am the Peter of this of my generation. Petero yasigara wona gamba tumna sinagendaga. Peter remained and, I, and he said nagenda wa eriani no bulamu obutakwa. Gowe kagori no bulamu obutakwa. Shall I go where there is eternal life? It is only you who has eternal life. I also tell you today, my friend, that the devil had made people to hate the gospel of eternal life. Into. And he makes us love tangible things. Thinking that he's going to divert from the divert us from there. Because when the devil sees that you no, you no longer get miracles from God, he will cause you to go to the false prophet. The false prophet will not tell you to repent. He will not talk about heaven. He will not talk about eternal life. He will only talk about the miracle. But never take that direction. Praise the Lord. I want us to go to Mark. Chapter 10. Verse 23. Mako esula kumi olinyo rabili mwesatu awo yesu ne yetoloza amasu nagamba abayigiriza abantu ngachi zibu abagagga okuyingira mu bwaka baka bwaka tunde yesu asobede tagala tugagawali does in jesus want us to be rich eh eh sajja uno na yatulete dengiri akatawa tagala abantu bagagawali does in he want people rich kira wa kira wa continue reading abayigirizwa Say, I'm also astonished today. Because Jesus is the same who made He became poor for his poverty to make us rich. Now why does he say that it is hard for a rich man to go to heaven? And people were amazed. How did he answer them? Clap your hands for that word. Jesus doesn't have any problem with making you rich. And in the garden of Eden, people were very rich. He had given them a blessing. Because in the garden, he had put silver and gold and everything of wealth. But when the earth sinned, he hid the, the gold in the underground. And people who tried to dig it out of there, they are overcovered by soil. But previously, the gold was on. How hard it is for those who trust in their own. God has no problem with making you rich. But never turn your wealth into God. Love for God. Never trust your world. Continue trusting in God. Continue seeking God. When God gives you tangible things, just put in the armpits and follow the one who has given you. Like you ladies, the more your husband gives you things, the more you draw near to him. That is how also God wants you to be. Continue. Verse 29. Now who can get saved? Because all people are seeking for wealth. Kidawasi. <laughs> 
Awa Petero, nata nulogu muga amanti daba. Fetu wale kabiyo na, netu kukobele. Yesu na agamba. Petu na mga ni Yesu. Peter told him, but Jesus, we had our bows. We forsook them and followed you. Amen. 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 The lady said we were prostituting. We forsook it and followed you. Now, do you want us to sit on the veranda and wait for your eternal life? You're talking about. Yes, we are. How did Jesus answer? Yes, we are. Yes, we are. Yes, we are. Yes, we are. Yes. Yes. That shall not receive a hundredfold. In this season, God wants to pay you a hundredfold. And He's going to give it to you. Amen. 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 All the houses he's going to give you, he will give your husband, he will give your wife and children. But also persecution is there. I want to give you a Nigerian individual. I heard a persecution is coming. And it has already started in the other nation. When you go to Nigeria, it started long time. They are, they are men called Bong Haram. They find over here and make a bomb blast. So in, in, in nations like Malaysia, a persecution has already started. Even Jesus talked about it. When he was a boy. Whatever is going on in the world, like the battles, it is the, 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 the coming of Jesus is due. The end times God has shown to many people that the end time is when Jesus has come back. What pleases me, even those who dream, dream, dream when they have been left. Because if they go, we would think they are pretending. But what is the reason that will cause us to be left back? Because we are focusing the gospel of Jesus on tangible things. Instead of the master plan which he calls. So he wants to give you tangible things. But there is persecution. When the person you can even lose the, 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 the material things. If they tell you, uh, uh, you deny Jesus, if you don't deny him, come out of your house. You will say, take the house. Say that Jesus is not a son of God. If you don't speak it out, I'm going to shoot you. Just tell them you are taking long. I know where I'm going. But born again who are focusing on material things, they will not manage to go through the persecution. Because they will be protecting their wealth. Amen. Amen. But in heaven there is wealth which is greater than what you have. However much you love them, you will leave them on the earth. People die and leave our kids in the city and they go. Amen. Love for Jesus. Full package of salvation. That is the full package. 
on the earth you're supposed to be well uh, uh, that even when persecution comes you go through and, and, and at the end you enter into eternal life love for Jesus let us, let us look at Paul talking about this in 1 Timothy chapter 6 and verse 6 to be contented what is it to be contented about because whatever, whatever you do you cannot make the best for it is the yearning for things all the time Amina. Amen. Kati, Kati, you, you, might a a you might see a man with a factory. But he's sleepless. He's still looking for other work. They don't sleep at night. You cannot, you cannot make a body to be contented. Body to be contented. But first be contented with God. There's nothing you'll take from the world. However much you accumulate them. First be contented. Yes. <laughs> If you're seeking for only possessions, you will go to the first place. Love of money. Love of money. <laughs> The love of money is the root of all kinds of evil. People kill their colleagues because of money. People do every kind of crooked things because of money. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Say I'm running away from them today. Mm-hmm. Clap your hands for those words. After that, mm. yes, mm. the Yes, Hold on to your call. Say, oh Lord, starting today, may you help me that I hold on to eternal life because that's the reason you called me. And the first prayer we're going to make today, say, oh Lord, show me anything that can make me miss out on going have you ever made that kind of prayer? Don't think when you acquire all the possessions of the world, God is finished. Inquire of Him today. I want to distinguish for you the wealth of the born again and the wealth of the world. Because God is going to make you rich. He has promised us. Verse 17. 
Okutilenga abagaga bo mirembe ya kaka Okutilenga abagaga bo mirembe ya kaka Eden revival Command those who are rich at Eden Oto 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 The wealth people of the world show off For us our kind of wealth is not for showing off Especially you ladies You know for me I've rented and a woman who is rich and renting and she does not show off ha, she's not a woman maybe Chayo, mukalu. the dry tea mukalu tea. she drinks it in the house inside the house. Gagawarale, but if the husband rich and brings milk inside the house will be very hot Gamba, mudono, yasoma, sell your neighbor And she tells the, the children, Johnny, Johnny, Why should you do all that? To show off to the neighbors. To show off. That is not the kind of wealth that has come from God. Praise the Lord. The boy that the child brings. You have brought bread alone. Bring also blue band. Mami, Mami, I'm not seeing it. Check behind the peanut butter. Tell your neighbor, stop that kind of show off. Amen. Amen. Then you, 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 you start smoking the chicken on the veranda. One charcoal stove is for the chicken, the other one is for beef. Then you tell mommy Edward. Poor woman is, is preparing cassava and beans. Mommy Edward, do you have some beans that I give you beef in the place of it? Because my children are tired of it. My children are tired of the meat, but Tata John also. Every time he's buying meat for Mami us. Edward, Mami Edward, help me and give me beans. I give you beef. It is that show off that will make the devil to hit you. Hallelujah. Amen. For us, our kind of wealth is It means responsibility. You become a pipeline through which that the wealth of God will pass to help the other people. Instead of showing off, help them. Give them the milk. Give them the, the, give them the bread. To eat. But that kind of show off is, is for the world. For the world. For the world. Hallelujah. Amen. Younger ones to read it. Continue. Okutirenga abagaga abom mirembe ya kakano obutera ganga obutera ganga ne wankubadde okwesigo obugaga obutali bwa lubere wadde okwesigo obugaga no to trust in wealth uncertain wealth point says ozimakinga are you marking those Katona points? Kuga, God is going to make you rich when you still have the Because he wants you to glorify him on the earth. But make, never turn your wealth into God. Sitani, the devil does not fear riches. He also has it. If you wanted to give it to Jesus, 
Jesus he told him he told him bow and worship that devil appears as a person who has Jesus but does not fear your money he will strangle you with your riches he said he gives you to get joy he knows that you are still on the world you are still in flesh he gives you to have joy and dress up well and feed well if he gives you money and you become mean to yourself that is also terrible because he has given you money to glorify him you lady God has given you money it is full in your pocket in your bag <laughs> why should you go to a window to buy three bras at 100 the rebras at 100 shillings those that have lost the straps young man God has given you money the reason you put on a blouse in the place of a shirt why should you do that ask the young man next to you that you, why are you keeping the money for you? you lady God has given you money never fail to buy a dress worth 850,000 amen that is the reason you lose markets you have money the husband is home he has stayed home like on Sunday you have money then you put on very long dresses sometimes it is yellowish or blackish there is no blouse uh, no up, but the dress is very long you are putting on nigina no they are the ones you are putting on the whole day then you welcome back your husband he has been seeing very smart ladies in the town so glorify God on such a Sunday the husband is there put on a high heel Hey. Hallelujah. Amen. Shake your neighbor and tell him stop putting on niggas. When the husband has come back, he doesn't want to see them. Pastor, please organize for us a seminar for the married women because they are code of dress they need to be told when he was dating you were you putting on niginas maybe at, at least niginas but you know you put on size 5 why should you buy size 11 and the foot women are really hard hallelujah amen he gives you money to have joy to feed well to dress up well go to Deuteronomy I want to focus on people who are mean to themselves a lady who is here and you have a husband I want to chapter 12 verse 20 mm -hmm. when the lord your god enlarges your border 
of what they sent. He has given you money. Uh-huh. Now we know you get out. Hmm. Now we know you get out. Now we know you get out. Now we know you get out. Tell your neighbor, always eat meat. Stop the endless bins. Tell your neighbor, always eat meat. Stop the endless bins. Esento zina mujajaro 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 neguara manda manda negagwa kono yonge na kamera uli mujajaro. You have the money, but you buy beans every day, every day, and you buy more charcoal to cook the beans every day. Atendo waliwa mujajaro. At least beans. Ne waliwa mnyewa. But the genus, genus pest. Waliwa mnyewa wangu kwenye fumba. There is that kind of genus pest you cook. I told you I'm an expert in women. Those genus that you cook outside. Hallelujah. Amen. One glass of genus and you, you, you fill a whole saucepan with water. And the genus become like milk and they pour out. John went to Mazi and he was being carried away. John bring the water. The Nazi went to go see Angang and go fumbo and go. Now could do him a sin. If I find you cooking that kind of gin at best, I will just run away. Musumali ndo maro kuri ya sija guli ayo. Pastor, please wait. That kind of gin at best. Negu yika no yongera mu Mazi. Negu yika no yongera mu Mazi. It pours out. You add more water. And you keep on Chokomusente adding. Yet you have a lot of money in the house. Love for our God. Love for our God. He gives you money to be happy. That you live in a good life. Let's go back in 2 Timothy. 1 Timothy. Mukaga. 6. Mukaga. 6. Mukaga. 6. Mukaga. 6. The next thing, do good. What they sent. He has given you money. Help people. Help some people. For us, the born again. You don't only help your siblings. You don't help your friends at all. Help even those who are hard to help. That's what I want to tell you. Everybody. You find children who are sent back home for school fees. I found a child who was sent home for school fees. He was in primary seven. He had been sent home for 50,000. Yet the, the exams were due. They told her when your colleagues are doing exams after you will stay outside for 30 minutes when I was driving I followed him he was crying on the road then I asked what's the problem they have sent me for school fees I didn't know anything about him and him. he told me what they had told him I asked how much money 50,000 I told him get the man and go back to school he will never know me does he know where I stay but God will know me help people while expecting your reward from God your children go to international school you pay three, three millions in a term but in the neighborhood there is a child who is sitting home ah, because of school that one will make you go to hell Yamba. help and God will bless you love for Jesus Ocho. Be rich in good acts. If your money has not helped the poor, it is a curse. God will take the money. If your money is not given to the poor, 
Nenga bagabi mm. Basenga chini Ocho Ngabete rekera yeah. Echi oku ima kechi runji yeah. Owebide vigendo okuja mm. Bali okiba nyue zenga mm. Obula mudalada Obula mudalada Obula guawo Kupila mungale chika ambeche mwana wa Lap your hand Obula gabole mekutu wala mugeena so that wealth does not take you to hell. He said it is hard for rich man to go to heaven. But here he has given us the definition of wealth. Our wealth is not going to take us to hell. As long as you do this work there. Amen. Amen. I want us to go to the part of deliverance. How does eternal life help us in deliverance? Go to the book of Daniel. Chapter 12. Verse 1. 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 Daniel. Chapter 12. Verse there will be a lot of tribulation. There will be a lot of tribulation. This book was written when there was remaining 700 years for Jesus to be born. But Jesus revealed it to him what would happen 2,000 years ahead. There was going to be tribulations as never before. Thy people shall be delivered. Thy people Say I'm going to be delivered today. Your people shall be delivered, but yes. not all. Yes. Hey. Hey. Love for God. God. God no longer delivers anyhow. Because there is no benefit in delivering you when you go to heaven. But after your name has entered in the book of life. Like we are going to repent today and our names shall be written in the book of life. The is going to be quickened soon. Very much quickly. Because he knows even when he delivers you. You will pursue the, the, the direction of eternal life. And you will run away from any spot that will make you miss out on heaven. God has delivered many people but they end up serving the devil. But for you he will deliver you and then you continue serving God. Hallelujah. Amen. That is why I tell you that today you are going to be delivered. Amen. Amen. Go ahead. Erabanti kuabo abeba kama ufufe yokuunsi. Yes. Bali zukuka. Abamu eri obla mowuta guao. Kocho. Na abamu eri ensoni. No kunyo mebo kuta guao. Mumbuli zemo no gora gawa. Ask your neighbor where are you going? So God showed this to this man. Even before people had accepted that resurrection. But God told him I will deliver people whose names shall be written in the book of life. Because there is no benefit in him delivering you and you enjoy life on the earth. Yet you will end in hell. So the, the deliverance of this time, this season is to hit two birds with one stone. On the, in the earth you're going to be well and you shall also be, go to heaven. Hallelujah. Amen. And the last thing the tree was taken out of Eden and it was taken back to heaven. We shall find it in heaven. Go to the book of Revelation. Chapter 2 and verse 7. 
Okubi kuriwa, esula biri, ori ni diyo rom sanvu. Ari no kutu, auri no moyo tia gambe kanisa. Awangula, ndi muo kuriya kumuti o gobulam. Oguri wakati, muri sukuru wakati onda. Kubi na moga le shiga mbeche wana. Clap your hands. Gatu chia leku sukuno. When you are still on the earth, Jesus ya fuko muti gobulam. Jesus became the tree of life. Tujia huwa ngatuli ya kuyesu. We shall be feeding on Jesus. When we go to heaven, we shall not feed on Jesus. We shall be reigning together with him. But there is a tree prepared. Whenever you are hungry, you shall go and feed on the tree. When it continues, you will last. You will stay for one day. Yes, love for our Jesus. Amen. There are find the time we That is why Jesus has garmented the church. I want you to love the gospel, putting on the garments of God. Hallelujah. Amen. More than loving tangible and more than loving the dry deliverance. But I want you to receive deliverance after your name has entered the book of life. Revelation 19. And verse 17. And verse 7. Okubi kuliwa. Esula kumi na moenda. Orinji diyo rom sanvu. Musa nyuke. Tu sa nyuke. Tu jiaguze. Tu muwe chitibwa ye. Kubango obgole bo mwana gwendika. Butu use. Obgole bo mwana gwendika. Butu use. Yani o mwana gwendigo yo. For the marriage of the Lamb has come. I told you many people have dreamt when Jesus has come back. A time has come, my friends. Hallelujah. It is my prayer that you and me we end up in heaven. Yes. 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 And he was given to put on a garment. Mm -hmm. At this time, Jesus is garmenting the church with the garment of righteousness. He has to stop the evil deeds. The devil is also garmenting his people. On the news. There are so many actions the world has started doing. All the feasts you hear of in Jesus, the devil is garmenting. The whites have entered schools teaching homosexuality to the the devil is garmenting and wants to take so many of them to hell. He has also raised you and me to garment people in order to enter heaven. And I want to tell you, my friend, my fellow minister here, God is not going to ask you. How many people did you pray for to give birth to Jesus? How many people did you pray for to get married? The question is, is going to be How many people did you make to enter in the kingdom of God? This one. When Jesus was giving a report upon the work of 17. Verse 2. He was praying to God when he was about to go back. He was giving his 17 verse 2. John. Yokana Kumina Msanvo. No Yiri Yorokubiri. Yokana. Ngabo wamu wabu yinza Kubali no mbili bonna Enabo nabe wamu wabu Aba wabu lamu wabu ta guawo Ocho Uno wabu lamu wabu ta guawo Katondo wabu wabu mazima No yogo watuma Yesu Christ You hear the report is given Te ya yoge la kube ya wanya He did not talk about those whom he healed Te ya wanya Te ya yoge la kube ya zuzu 
whom he resurrected. He said like you gave them to me to give them eternal life. Baba no. Here they are. Go to verse 12. Bwe nali nabo bewampa. Nabakuma muri nyaliyo. Yes. Era ne mbazi bibira. Tekubulanga muntu kubbo. All of them, the way you gave them to me, uh, that I give them eternal life, they are all here. Apart from the son of perdition, Judah. And Judah because it was written, he will be lost. Will you speak of all that? You know, in churches we are contending for congregation. But I sure you'll make all of them go to heaven. Have you, have you had a question? Hallelujah. Amen. We are also going to give the same report. The people who have entered. Go to verse 17, 18. You sent me in the world. Mm-hmm. I also have sent you. Jesus sends you to make people enter heaven. I find people preaching the gospel on the street. Go to verse 18. 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 Go to verse 18 but you're telling them about tangible things. Tell people about entering the kingdom. All the other churches in Kanisa we are going to pray. Yes. Yes. I did not get it. Time to teach about repentance. Now there is a church where I went. A man preached a very good gospel. Was of repentance. Or when we started Terrible it was like a baby cool. Bent but the legs. I was, I was pulling my legs. People joke with repentance. That, that that was, was, I was sitting behind. There was a young woman nearby me. She had gone the tune. Saying what? God had <laughs> Hallelujah. Amen. She was dancing. Lord, I repent. I repent. <laughs> now you this. But hear this. I want it now. Your husband. He has found you in a lodge with another man. You stand over there. And tell him. My husband, I repent. <laughs> Amen. Before you even speak a word, you know, 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 you
broken heart. God must see your heart broken. He said a broken and contrite heart shall be May your heart be broken. And say Lord I was about to miss out on it. And I thank you because, because you have revealed it to me the gospel of the kingdom of God. And later God is going to do God is going to deliver you through all you want. Stand up on your feet. Oli motu kufu. Oli. Motu kufu Motu kufu Yes Yes Lord Oli Ani wogamba motu kufu ye Katonda ulira mutima nge mwate jina yimba Omutima kukwele kuyimba motu kufu God is, God is focusing on your heart whether your heart is singing or voice whenever you're, you're, you're singing for God take away all your thoughts and let your spirit worship Oli Motokovu Yesu Oli Motokovu Yes, Lord. Oli, Motu Kovu. Motu Kovu. Yes, Lord. Oli, Wachi Tiwa. Yes, Lord. Oli, Wachi Tiwa, Wachi Tiwa, Yes, Lord, Wachi Tiwa, Wamu Wendo, Wamu Wendo, Yes, Lord, Oli, Kabaka <laughs> Nzize mu masogo Tukwe ya nziza katonda wa fesebo Uwe chigambo chotumie Uwe bali kabaka wabaka bake chigambo chotira mumo kama Nga tulimo sizo nienu katonda wa katonda mukama Eyo kuonye zewa mukama tata nuku sumulua Katonda waba katonda mukama Tukuleke viko ligo mukama Tukiriza katonda wa fesebo tato Olimurunjo oliwamanyi Uwe bali kuruwa tata wa fesebo 
kwafe weba lolwe chigambo cha tuwadde weba le kwatu me chigambo chono tuonya no tujja mu kuzikirira kabaka wa kabaka emporogoma ya yuda mukwano gwange tuze joli mukama nga tuli mbulambu no mukama obwe bisera no mukwano gwange tate byenkomerero katonda wa bakatonda mukama tata munange ntege Sera be tu kama katonda waba kalamu katonda mube musai tu kuri na mani tu tu no tu zene chibi na chino mukama tu wa miti majia fe waba katonda mukama ntege de katonda mukama tu wa kwanyo mukawa. Katonda waba katonda nga koze saguno mubiri mukama nga boyogedde mu chabo cha luberi eberi esatu mukama ai katonda waba katonda mukama totu no tuwayo mitima ja fetu komye wojoli mukama tuno nyabula mu butagwawo katonda waba katonda mukama tata tusobolo ku sikiro bwaka bako bomo mukama tuade tu ya yani de bintu ebigwawo katonda waba katonda yesu tulabye katonda waba katonda mukama bible yetu gambye mitabo cha yokana mukama ti yesu te wafa muguru kokola byo yagala wabule cha kuleto kuva mu wanu kamo chiti wanu leke biti bwabye ngengo zo kokola echo katonde yakutuma mu kwano gwange tata cha yagala kabaka waba kabaka mukama yesu twe wayo joli mukama oluna kulwa lero duka kana wansi wo mukono gwo mukama nge cha kuleta yenza ikatonda ba katonda ne chibina chino mukama tata munango sobolo kutu na kulwa lero mukama bafuta za fe mukama katonda waba katonda ngo ogen twalo ya ino mutimo gutu kiride mukama ogenda kutwala aba ine biro woze birongo fuga iride oyogede mitabo cha luberi eberi mukaga sato ti mukama na yogera ti omoyo gwange teguwa kanenga na muntu kubanga na yegwe mu biri mukama tukwega iride tata munange tunaze mukama tukuza katonda waba katonda mukama mu biri guno mukwano gwe miemeza fe mukama nga gwawamba mukama tata sebo muli che tukola chona katonda waba katonda mukama tubade kutukirizo mu biri guno mukama katonda tagwa wa mukama atu sasire sonyi wakatonda wakatonda tuluwa nilido kutukiri izo kwe gomba kwa mubiri mukama saa takabaka wabaka baka mukama netuwe rabina mkwanu wange tata sebo kito kenda kuno na mubiri mkwanu wange kubanga kuno mubiri oyokete mitabo chalu beri ebe 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 musa Katonda mukama no diro muntu ali atonde ba mujifana nyicho mungeri yo mukama ko watondo mufuka katonda ba katonda mukama nata sobolo kuingira mbula mu butagwa wa mukama nata wa mutonda mujifana nyicho buno mubiri mukama chitange kabaka waba kabaka mukama we gubade gutufuka katonda tagwa wa mukama naza tukuza katonda waba katonda mukama otulongo seze dala katonda wange mwa mukama twene nyolwo busungu twene nyolwo kwera likirira Neno nyoro nero enako nene nyamu kama tata sebo ruo kutia okugwa mamanyi ebiro wozo byone ebibi mukama tubadde twawambi wa mukama ngatufugibwa mu biri mukama katonda waba katonda mukama enako ebadde jude munda mutima mukama bible yetu kambe na kuzijula munda mutima tata munange zikukutabia katonda waba katonda mukama tukobere to mu biri katonda wange tata munange sabone twera biro bula mu butagwawo watugamba katonda waba katonda mukama yekuke beri twala mukuru mukama tata munange funda mukama Kabaka <laughs> Bala za fembi mukama, ebiro wazonga bibi mukama, naibuli yetu gamba kulo wazoko. Kwa wamo kama, yes, tuene. Niamu na ange, hatu nazo, tu sasire mukama, na katonda, mwani nyeri ayesu, mwana katonda.
Namo, amboti magwange mukama, katonda waba katonda mukama, na kulia tu gambi mata yesule yeku mine mukama, di Yesu wa wanyi siwa, engwa yezone zitu kula, echi ambalo nechi tu kuziwa, no wanyi siwa mukwano gwange, kabaka waba kabaka mukama, no funo bula mo buta guawo, no soboro kuangula, na fetu zemukama, makati mosizo ni jetu limo, ebi kemo vingi katonda waba katonda, ebi somo zavingi mukama gulse, na tu mano mukama, yefebe wajiro kuva muguru mukama. Ngo tunono kututu alambula mwabuta kwa wakatonda wange Tata muna ngo bucha hivyo tuvade tulina Haba chala na habami mukama Haba nabo mukama Basi ngo mukama Tulo woze vintu vinji mukama Na yoru alero mukama Nga wetu komye wajori katonda wabakatonda Mukama tungo seze dala mukama Otu zeyo mchifana nyicho mukama Otu kuzeme mezafe Olongo so mutima mukama Na ibuli yetu gamba mitabo cha zapo Tulongo se mokama, tuze bujia mokama, na ibulie gamba fetu libumba, yesu. Watu wa moti mwa mulongofu, wa moti mwa ugutu kiride, wa moti mwa ugufana na moku gwa ikatonda, wa katonda, waku waguna asobo la mokama, waku gumikiriza mokama, waku na asobo la katonda, waku mukama watu gamba ikatonda wange mwari nyeri ya yesu mana katonda wa mulamo, na ataka baka wabaka baka mokama, nitu balenge bibala, nebibala biya. Yes, we met him at Jirongo, say, I'm not him, I'm only in Bamok. Mokama, not a no to Aula Mokama, not to go to Lakubi Koligo Mokama, yes, Unque Gairida, Abanga Kabida, Unque Gairida Katonda, Wangeta, Bible, you to Gambia Mitabocha, Daniel Katonda. Katonia, yes, so mana Katonda Molamo. Bebo boka mukama bagendo kuwani kwa mchita becho bulamu atonda waba katonda mukama nata munange to twitter ko mukama to tugoba nata sutu zebuja katonda waba katonda tuwani kwa mchita becho bulamu obuta kwao nata tusobola kusomulwa watu kutuleke bikoli kwa mukama atonda waba katonda mukama tubera abana bo mukama tusobola kufanana moyito mugambe Yesu nkwega balero katonda waba katonda tuwa mutimo mujja mukama omutimo agutu kiride mukama Ogenda koma wako kunona katonda wange Ya doru fenyiro katonda waba katonda Abo boka bali no muti mwa kutu kiride Aba tu waka baka wamo kama Aba ingira mbula mwabuta kwa wamo kama Tulimu kuyomba gana Tulimu kweru maruma Aba sumba na aba wereza Eka nisa mwaka ma Tuluwa nila aba antu mwaka ma Nata muna ngeka baka waba kabaka Netu vaku bula mwabuta kwa wamo Na yodu wadero mwaka ma Na aba antu bano mwaka ma Aba wereza abo mwaka ma Aba kiriza mwaka ma Aba kunonyeza mwaka ma Mwana kuzino musambu mwaka ma Katonda waba katonda mwaka ma Oku auli wa mwaka ma Nata muna ngeke sebo Chusi wa mwaka ma Viva levi wa moyo Viva levi wa mwaka ma Baga lati ya tana vili mwakubili Atonda waba katonda Yesu tata, tukwe taga mugambe mukama mpo mutimu wa mutima Wa mutimu wa mulongofu, wa mutimu wa gutu kiride Wa mutimu wa gwa katonda, wa mutimu wa gugendo kunyamba Hoku soboro kwa uliwa wange, hoku yimira katonda wange Mwiso moza mukama, katonda waba katonda mukama Baibuli ya gambi ya mukama, yebye sita za webidi mukama Na yezi musanzo ya bileta, haba bileta mukama Neba bata kulida bula mbuta kwa wamo kama Na hata fetu ya uliwa No musai kwa yesu mkama Tu hata gabula mbuta kwa wamo kama Nusobolo kufasiwa Nusobolo kuwanyisiwa Nusobolo kufana na mkama Katonda waba katonda Yesu tu omotimu omuja Omotimu omulongofu Nambale vyo butu kufuno butu kirivu Na hata muna nge tuvera haba gole Haba sani de katonda wange Ngo koma wamo kama Nga tuwe tese tese mkama Otu wale mbula mbuta kwa wamo kama Mwari nyeri ya yesu mana katonda omulamo Na hata tuvero mbuta kwa wamo kama Katonda haba katonda yesu Be wajio kunona mukama Hoku tuteka teka mukama We wawe mbalirira Katonda waba katonda mukama Yabo vena lina wena vo Bona katonda wange Tata muna nge mba tu siza Hoku jako yomana woku vula Tata te tukenda kufula Te tukenda kufako Hodu wadero tu haule Tata kabaka waba kabaka Kuhiro woze viensi Kuhintu viensi mukama Kumagezi gensi mukama Kukwa gade vintu mukama Katonda waba katonda mukama Hotu wai katonda wange Ekisecho mukama Katonda waba katonda mukama Yesu hotu sangule mukama Tata muna nge mshabe chavo nonye Mwari nyeri ya yesu wamana kama Katonda wa mulamo, tata tukuziwe katonda waba katonda Tanana mukama, mwari nyeri ya yesu wa mana katonda wa mulamo Wetu na ingina mbulamo wabuta kwa wamo kama Otu sumulo tujie kebi koliko, yone iba
Debi to Londola, Ebi Debi to Tambulako, Oluna Kuruade Romo Yito Mukambe Mukama, Ungo Nongo Seza Mukama, Mobula Mobutaguawa Mukama, Atonda Waba Katonda Mukama, Pandi Kamushabechi, Chobula Mobutaguawa, Echira Mechabe Chaba Tukirivu, Echita Mukame Chaba Kufanana, Baibulia to Gamba Yesuwe Yasaba, Abangena Wan Yesiwa, Katonda Waba Katonda, Engo Yazene Zitukula, Obweni Wenebu to Kuziwa, Molinia Yasomana Katondo Mlamo, Nafuko Muntu Amalala, Mumania Gomo Yamatukufu, Nayingi Rambula Mobutaguawa, Obuga Katonda Mukama, Atu de Kumukono Guadio, Nanga Gweneta Gamukama, Nabantuano Mukama, Yes, Moyite, 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 Mogambo, Ruade, Don Quita, Catonda Wange, Omasai Guaya, Sukunja Ulayo, Kunja Ulayo, Mochikache, Wafe, Labuya, Yogana Mochigambo, Yomukama, Yavana by Sirai Mukama, Ruadio Bawai, Catonda Wange, Natamunanga, Savonga, Vayingida, Mulamo Butagua, Mukama, Natamunango, Abagamba, Betukuze, Catonda Waba, Catonda Mukama, Webe to Kuzai, Catonda Wange, Waba, Ula Mukama, Natamunanga, Sebo, Wate Kawa Mukama, and Yaulo Mukama, Katonda waba katonda tu awuli ya mukama kwe vya iba debi gobelela iba debi rondola obu sive mukama obu omuviri mukama katonda waba katonda endo waza zafe otu wa motimo muja wa motimo maririfu wa motimo guline mirembe wa motimo gubale vivala evi obu katonda oku agala kwa katonda mukama tetu sorola mukambe mukama po motimo kwa agala bala bebange na ibuli etu gamba mumatayo ni mua awuli ya weba gambiwa yo ya galanga mukama Naye nange nkugamba yo yagalango mulabewo muri nyeri ayesoma na katondo mulamo tata mukama tukolera bulamu butagwawo okwagala ko Yesu kwakuleta je tuli mukama babali ne bibi mukama katonda waba katonda wo mukazo no mutima wo musajjo yo mutima omujja mukama okulino okwagala okulino emirembe olwairo tuwangula ebikoli go byonna ebade bitulondola koloko ka muri nyeri ayesoma na katondo mulamo omugambe mukama olwalero katonda aba katonda mukama nja wula mukama tata sebo kubikoli go byonna Debi non dola, echo kule merewa, echo kufiriziwa, echo kude marega, echo buta kula kula na, oru ai don chiwangula, madi nyeri ai soma na katondo mlamo, tu wangula ebi kodi gobiona, ebi debi tu gobereda, ebi obuafu, ebi obuta fundiwa, ebi obuta wasa, ebi obuta zala, oru ai don tu biwangula, madi nyeri ai soma na katondo mlamo. Aho eni ne wali ito musai gua yesu, nywa o musai gua yesu kakati. Olinga huku na azamu Embala ya stani yona Call upon the blood of Jesus To cleanse out of you the character of the devil Mchara gobu Omsungu obu huku na azamu Na msaigu wa Yesu You led that anger is cleansed out of you The blood of Jesus Toiza kubweja muto ina maji Gamu sora kubweja You don't have the strength to take that anger out of yourself Ebilo osebi obwezi Toiza kubweja muweka You cannot take out the thoughts of fornication by yourself. God had taken away the communication with you. Because the, the spirit had, was defiled. But God is cleansing you with the blood of Jesus. Jealous anger and thoughts of fornication and adultery. Every thought that is ungodly is the one God wants to first deliver you in. Oh Jesus, Lord Jesus. Start eating Jesus. Eat the spirit of Jesus Christ. Eat the spirit of Jesus Christ. And eat love. That is the gown you're putting on now. You used to dream when you're naked. You're now going to dream when you're putting on white garments. When you're putting on the, the garments of the soldiers, because you're a soldier. Because Jesus, the fighter, is, has, has entered you. Eat the eternal life, and that is Jesus. Jesus, we are not here to know the chief of coral. When you eat of Jesus, whatever He is, you're going to become of it today. Jesus, we are going to get a cool angle of life. Jesus is a victor. You're going to overcome every kind of condition. Eat love. Today, we are going to be in. Never have any other enemy. You remain with only one enemy, and that is the devil. Your co-wife is not your enemy. The demons of fornication are your enemy. Oh Lord, 
Whoever was failing to have sleep, crying, eat the peace of Jesus now. Wipe the tears and eat the joy of Jesus Christ. Today is going to be your first day to have the peaceful sleep. If you are having a sleepless night because of worry, you came without anything, you'll go back without anything. Nothing should make you restless. Eat patience. Be patient with the mockers. Be patient with the condition you're going through. Oh Jesus Lord. Eat of the grace. Have mercy on people. Even those you don't know. Have mercy. And the, because of the condition they are going Sasira through. Abono, have mass on sinners and preach the gospel to them. Oh, then it means you have oh, you've entered the eternal life. Oh, you've entered the book of life. At this moment, as we enter the blood of Jesus, it, we are going to, it is going to make a covenant. Yes, Christ. We are going to make a covenant with Mugenda Jesus Christ. You are going to be one with Jesus. He's going to deliver you from all the covenants of, of your family. The covenants of the dead that you used to dream about. The covenants of the clan of witchcraft. You woman you have bewitched and you lost your faith. Today you have eaten Jesus with power. They be they bewitched you with the blood of hens and goats but you have the most precious blood that is above all the kinds of blood stand up on your feet stand up on your feet nobody is remaining in bondage to them nobody will remain with any kind of your raise up your hands oh, confess your problem and Tell him, Lord, it is you who when I enter in the book of life, I shall not remain with any condition. There is a man here, you have a lot of debts. But Jesus took all our debts. I speak to you today that starting tomorrow, it is going to be a new condition. There is a way God is going to create for you. You will be amazed with the power of God. You will be amazed with the power in the eternal life. Oh Jesus Lord. You woman who had, who had tumors in the stomach. Jesus took all our diseases. You'll be amazed when you go back for the scan. When there is no tumor in your womb. Oh, Jesus. One who was tormented with bad dreams. You dream when you're in having a sexual intercourse with men. You dream when cars are chasing you. Those are, the, those are the demons that come from ancestral demons. But today, because of the covenant of the blood of Jesus, God is taking you out of the dungeon in which the devil threw you. Yes, Lord. Wow, mkama. You've told us, oh Lord, that you're going to give us a hundredfold when you're still on the earth. Oh Lord, I have no jobs. We shall not follow people of the world. If people in the world are jobless, for us our jobs are there because we're using the blood of Jesus. Because we use the Holy Spirit. He's going to look for jobs for you. He's going to and put favor on you. Before, among this, all who do interviews, they are going to choose you. Lord, deliver each and everyone. Whichever issue everyone has confessed, 
is a person you have nowhere to sleep wherever you go they send you away but the God who planted Adam and Eve in the garden is planting you somewhere next week you woman who had trouble in your home in your marriage the devil wants to make you miss out on your marriage the demon of lack of unity with your husband has come in the demon of adultery has entered your home but one inside of you is more powerful than those demons it is coming out of your home in the name of Jesus it is being burnt with fire God is planting you and establishing you today raise your hands up say oh lord after you have given me a hundred fold on the earth may you get for me a place in heaven you said oh lord that you, are, you, you have gone to prepare places for us my oh lord may you show it to me in which I am going to sit thank you lord thank you jesus Give him a great hand. Give him a bigger hand clap. Kubido moyo muda temu, ulwe chisa, mukama mati tute, mlinyeri ya Yesu. Hallelujah. Kubido mukama munga le zamani. Hallelujah. Let's give a big hand clap to our pastor. Say may God bless you. Thank you so much. Let's sit for just a while. Before we enter the next session. I want married wives may you give a hand up to pastor has given you a chance he's going to come we shall be here on the third for, uh, on the fourth started of the month of the month that we are entering starting tomorrow I know he has a busy schedule. If he has given us that chance, we can't miss on it so that he can go when he has given us that opportunity already. But we are greatly blessed today. Tell neighbor what is going to be in this place this evening. You are going to see what eyes have not seen. What ears have not heard. And what sons of men have not heard before. We are going to see touch and be used in them. That's what God is going to do this evening. Amen. Amen. So we are going to before we go to the next session I'll ask get your offering which you came with in the house of God your thanksgiving money for building we are building brethren we are furnishing a God's house right from the fellowship part up to the administration block so we need your money so we need your stand, we need your hand. So that we can accomplish the work of God. Because he claims of it. Another thing, if you have gone to the toilets, have been there today. 